He's wearing a white shirt and then an eggshell He's suit a wet jacket. Grunge look. <laughs> a wet grunge look. Hello, my fellow explorers. So I lied. We are here again yes. to do one more final review before the summer. So for those of you who aren't aware, this past Monday was the Met Gala that brings in fashion designers and celebrities to raise money to have the exhibit that they have every year at the Metropolitan uh, Museum. Art Museum. Yes, and it's this, it's basically the Super Bowl of fashion for the year because all there's always a theme and all of the designers and the celebrities, they specifically, a lot of the clothes are designed specifically for this event and to match the theme, and it's a good time. And this year's theme is Heavenly Bodies, Fashion in the Catholic Imagination. Yes. And the reason that that applies to us at all is the fact that I am Catholic and she is not. I'm Lutheran. So we thought it would be really interesting to put our perspectives and our love of this event, because it's one of our favorite events, we were screaming about it all over Twitter and to each other. As well as our knowledge of, like, religion and the Catholic religion. Mm -hmm. and, and our knowledge of fashion, because we're both yeah. super into that, even though neither of us have any sort of degree in it. And we're wearing t-shirts and hats. Yeah. But so... Oh, we should have dressed up. <laughs> Put my prom dress back on. <laughs> but we thought it would be interesting to have, to, like, talk about our own opinions and views and, like, seeing how, like... Some of the clothing, I understand what the representation is, but some other people may not. Anyway, so, this is a Catholic and a non-Catholic review the Met Gala 2018. Let's go. Okay. So we're starting with Naomi Watts, and she looks to be wearing a bed sheet. Kind of baroque. That was, yeah, that's what I was going to say. Like, it's pretty up close, but and it's, it, uh, it's really, kind of matronly in a way, I guess. I really can't tell it. it Okay, this honestly, it looks like a curtain. <laughs> it looks like the curtain slash bed sheet. Yeah. That works. Next. Ugh. Phoebe Waller Bridge. I don't know who you are. Oh, I don't know who Christopher Kane is, but he could have. I, I know the name Christopher Kane. I don't get this oh. more joy with. I don't know what she's doing. She looks to be eating a trunk, like a tree trunk, or. No. Oh, that's a boob. Oh, do you... Oh, that's a. That's a sixty-nine. That's a sixty-nine. Rebel Maybe it's like a idea. sin. Maybe it's like one of the seven deadly sins. So like okay. maybe it's like lust. The paint, a doa, like a boa, on her, the burning bush before it burned. <laughs> yeah, I was like the burning bush before. No, just skip the boys no. who are stupid. Ugh, so many boys who did not come to this doing their research. What's the point of coming to an event if you're just gonna wear a black suit? There was something on yeah. Tumblr that said the girls showing up to the Met Gala wearing just a crown or a halo is the equivalent of a girl showing up to a Halloween party in just cat ears. <laughs> like flower crowns like at Coachella that too. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, I forgot about this guy I don't okay. know who you are. That's P. Diddy's son. Christian oh. Holmes and Dolce & Gabbana and Everyone's like it's on theme. It's not on theme. That's like the huge debate. This feels like a reference to like the Borgias or something Who the fuck? I <laughs> <laughs> what are these shoes? Uh, no next what the fuck is this? Claire Danes That's Claire Danes? I can't. Why her blonde hair? Two years ago, she wore a fiber optic beautiful dress by Zach Posen, and then she comes with this. No. Kate Upton, okay. She okay. she at least went with the theme. I like the, the ones that did like the, the veil kind dress? of thing. Her outfit was like Roman meets like Catholicism. Alexa Chung. Why? What is she supposed to She looks like an acolyte. You call them altar boys? <laughs> you have another term? Oh. Acolyte. Never heard that one before. Because girls can do it. Just call them altar servers. Ah, oh, I don't. Look at me wearing this on is that? Why? Why do you Is this like a fourth person trying to dress as it's Joan of Arc? It's a Joan of Arc look. Next. Like of all the people y'all could have dressed as, everyone picked Joan of Arc. Like it's oh, fine. Oh, it's Jennifer Connelly. Oh, that's not Demi Moore. Wait, let's. Zoom we in. both thought it was Demi Moore. It looks like. Oh, okay. It is we Jennifer use, Connelly. We zoom in. It's Jennifer Connelly. <laughs> we both thought that was. I Demi was like, Moore. oh come on, Demi Moore. You can I don't get the top. Better. Like, the, the two just don't go together. Yes. Tessa Thompson. Thompson. Ooh. Can you guess why I like her outfit? <laughs> Explain to me why you like this outfit, Stephanie. Best. Her jacket is fun. Oh, is it? Oh my god, let's zoom in. Oh, Issa! Hi, queen! She looks pretty, and I love Issa Rae, but I don't know if she could have been. Mm, this is like the but, black version of Naomi Watts. I was gonna say that. Literally, Literally the that. background. <laughs> no, I just mean like the background is. <laughs> she means the dress, not the person. Um, oh! Did you see that picture of her? I and don't she was like SpongeBob this. and Patrick with the tan, and then it was her in. There was her that one, and then there was like, the you know, the vine with the kid covered in peanut butter? Uh. 
They shouldn't have done this to her. Did they cover her? She said, her I watched the interview or? with her, with Liza Koshy, and she said she was trying to embody Esther. Okay. Just someone from the Bible. But, like... Look it up if you want to know more. Ugh. No. Everyone's like, such a good look. I'm like, where? Woo! Let me see. Janelle Monet. You did that, girl. I feel like this is Joan of Arc with, like, the chainmail meets the Pope on a day out. And then, the like, hat. saints. Because they, they like, this is the halo. You know, like, yeah, so the underneath saints, is like, the halo. You know, and then, they, but the hat in general is like yeah. the Pope's, like, oh, going yeah. out hat. Okay, this is what happened with the Nicki Minaj sitch. So basically, Migos and Cardi B have been, like, painting her out to be this, like, horrible liar in the media. And then Nicki Minaj is like, this really hurt my feelings. I would never do this to them, blah, 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 blah. And I feel really hurt that all this stuff happens. I'm sure you could look it up. Anyway, she showed up to the Met Gala as the fucking devil because, and she, quote, she said something along the lines of, people want to paint me as the bad guy, so I showed up as the bad guy. It's not my favorite, but I really like it for what she did because she was, like, one of the only people that showed up as, like, Satan and, like, heavenly bodies. Yeah. Which, because he was a heavenly body. I wanted her, thank, this is where I'm going. She needed wings. I thought this was really cool. I haven't even seen it. You haven't seen Carla Delavines? No. I think she was going as like a sinner. You know those things where you're like, I'm going to confession and they have those like panels. Yeah, so I think that's how she okay. was going as like a sinner. Oh, oh, okay, okay. I get it. Oh, oh, because she's behind the panels. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I think I'm that's done. I think that's what she was going for. Me, I'm like, she's I'm going as the panels. <laughs> she's going as the panels. <laughs> Boo! The, the Do entire better. family. Do better! <gasps> have you seen your TV show? Praise be. This is a costume. Zendaya boo. She like really, What's she up? came out to cosplay. Like, let me tell you. Versace, Tiffany and Co. Jimmy G Choo, she did it all. Oh, Solange girl. I don't know what she was going as, but I like it. Okay. Like, I, like I get the, I, I get the, the braided halo and the, um, yeah. I, I did watch an interview. I just didn't get the dress part of it. I don't know what the dress was. I'm confused by that. But the do-rag looked great. Oh, yes, queen. God bless. This pairing, because you know they went to drama school together? No. They did not talk about this dress enough because I didn't know, I didn't know the backstory of it. Yeah. So if you don't know, she is basically embodying um, like Ethiopian, like religious iconography. And like it has a little crosses on the bottom. Yeah. And it's just, I like that it's a different take on Catholicism. Yeah. Because I mean, look in the history books. It's everywhere for a reason. Yeah. But we're not going to get there. And Cardi B, here you go. She's wearing gloves. Yes. Ooh, They're like whole arm. Mm -hmm. It's a lot. And I think they have nails on them. <gasps> oh, that makes me so uncomfortable. I feel like I would be itching in that though. I just want to say Cardi B is very problematic and I do not like her. However, this is amazing. This is well done. Her weave, great. Cynthia Arrivo, she okay. won the Tony two last summer for the color purple. She was trying to go as a wine chalice. Like, oh, or like, like, so the color of wine and then like with the architecture. I was gonna say she's the color of like, the carpet. <laughs> or like the chairs, like the pews, you know, when they have the pews. Like an old, like it, yeah! like it turns it we hasn't have, been re renovated in years. Pews, but like, there was a, ooh. there was a church near us who had orange carpet. Orange this orange. one, I, I don't get at all. She's supposed to be like the priest on Easter. Oh, I was like, getting some like, piece, like the Jackie Pope? O vibes like, out of this. Okay, girl, that's what I thought. Oh my I god. I was like, I was girl, like, do you Jacqueline oh no? Like, like what's okay, happening? No. You know, they came. They're alive. That's all that really matters. <laughs> I, I like the concept I don't know, I'm not her hair is messed throwing me off. I don't know why. I just don't like there's something about this. It's not doing it for me. I think Gigi Hadid is not doing it for me. Mm. Why did I think Mary J. Blash was Nini Leaks? <laughs> Oh, I swear to God, I did. Oh my God. Oh my God, why is she still there? Madonna as the Madonna? I can't. Like, she's been waiting for this theme her entire life. Her entire, like, outfit choices are literally have been crosses since the 80s. It's Madonna, that's her brand. Ugh. This is, this is really ugly. I'm sorry, but blue with a red background cross. But you know what really bothers me, though? I used to like Balmain. Is that? But then Balmain, they did Beyonce's Coachella look. She looks like a peacock that's religious. All right. With the J-Lo leg. Also, I feel like she's not that relevant anymore. Trevor, no, you can't just put a cross on something and It's call better it a than day. all the other guys, though. You're not wrong. Okay, I like this, this one. I thought cute. it was fun. This is This is the same guy who did no. Cardi B's. Ooh. 
Oh, oh. It's very the out jewels? there, but it's it's very Moschino. Ooh. Anyone who did like jewel, jewelry and beadwork on their dresses, amazing. Like he was I feel like you almost like Jeremy Scott was really with the this theme. Of the night. You should have had that. some beadwork on your dress. I don't know how I felt about this one. At first, I thought it was like a military outfit. I with, can tell you that I don't like it, but also, what is it? I don't get Catholic out of this at all. When did I literally Emma Stone get, turn 40? I literally get a military like uniform out of this. That's it's a punching V. Maybe it's like the Crusades. Ooh. <laughs> so this is a wafer. This it's communion wafer. Communion wafer, or I am convinced she's dressed as Lazarus. 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 <laughs> Lazarus coming right. out of the cave. She's like wrapped as a mummy and has these things trailing. She could be Jesus coming out. Michelle Williams. Lay Miss Joan of Arc. Yeah. Next. <laughs> and I had high hopes for you. Miss Jen so Lindley. <gasps> yes! He did his homework. Chadwick, we love you. We appreciate you. He had so many options, too. Let's talk about his hair and how it was shiny like the cosmos. It had glitter. He had glitter in his fro. In honor of all of the headdresses of the Met Gala, <laughs> I put on my graduation cap. Ooh, 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 ooh. <sighs> I love this. I think everything about this is so beautiful. It's gorgeous. See, this reminds me of non Eurocentric Catholicism. Because this looks like it was Indian inspired, first off. Spanish, like, interpretations. Ooh, they Rana really Del came Ray. out here to play. Lana Del Rey and Jared Leto. So, if you don't know, what she is wearing the Bleeding Heart, which is a very famous painting. Don't know by who. I've been saying that Jared Leto looks like Jesus during his final week with, like, the crown of thorns and everything. And then um, Chadwick looks like Jesus rising. Ooh, ooh, she looks I really so like good. this. Okay, this I was love... so pretty. Is this the Sistine Chapel? Yeah, it's okay. the back of the Sistine Chapel on her dress. The dress, the structure of the dress itself is beautiful. Okay, and I love, love, love that the colors are muted. Okay, I really, I think I'm a fan of this I one. I like this one too. Taylor, Taylor Hill, you, yeah. you did a good job. I, I really love Diane von Furstenberg, but no, this I, is very clear, like, representation of the clergy. Oh. Vera Wang. This looks like she spent so much time on Ariana Grande's dress that she just had to throw something together. Greta Gerwig oh. gives me life. I love her so much. Listen, you did it. It's on theme. It's not the f most flashy, but it still works on theme and it still looks good. Like she looks And people are still gonna it. notice you. Yes. Nice. For like someone who went to Catholic it. school her entire life. True. Like, or at least high school. Stupid. This is not prom. Were you at Coachella? Or Coachella. This is not a mixture between Coachella and prom. Yay, you're together. Oh, I can't. Man. Shailene Woodley, I love you. I love Shailene so much. So she's such a great actress. That's all we can say. She's this is like actress. the Spanish Inquisition. I see. I I don't know if this is quite Joan of Arc because I don't exactly remember Maybe the era. Maybe it's not. Someone I feel like this is the Spanish was, Inquisition. But you're right. That it's like, the ruffled. Yes. It's the ruffled arm. Brooke Shields. This isn't the Oscars. I, I mean, I know it looks like his. really white pants. <laughs> it looks like she's wearing gauchos. <laughs> Is this middle school, Brooke Shields? Woo! Stop, Frances McDormand. She did. I it. don't get it, but I like it. Have you seen the thing that said it said, <laughs> "How can you be so dramatic yet so underwhelming at the same time?" Okay, it, you, you look made good. Me feel so, oh, girl, I would. What you look so it? good, but. But it's a thing. What is it? A banana? <laughs> oh my god. Ew. I can't. This is her. <laughs> this isn't Princess Beatrice. This isn't the Queen's granddaughter. Ooh, who's our parent? Fergie of York. Andrew? Edward? Oh. One of Charles's younger brothers. So goes, Louis, and Andrew, Edward. Name a white person. It's, I think his brothers are Andrew and Edward. Like, England literally, like, rebelled against the, like, Catholic Church. And y'all give, give us this? Y'all give us this? This is your time! I get oh. SZA! So good. For your first time, you killed it. This is one of my favorite She's headpieces. She's the crying Madonna. Did you see her tears? Mm hmm Ooh, Lena Waithe. Girl. Ooh, I SZA. Is. Ooh. I like her outfit. I like what she's like bringing attention oh. to. At a Catholic event? Awk. <gasps> Finally. Can we stop? Did you see SZA when she was like, they're like, Rihanna, Rihanna, and she goes, Rihanna? Rihanna? She came in a Pope mobile for one. The headdress is more Orthodox um, yeah. Christian. So the Catholic Church ones are a little more rounded Maybe instead of pointy on the side before going up. The beading on this is amazing. I want to say more about this, but like, I really don't know what to say. Like, 
She wins. I feel like no one could quite understand the theme of this one. I liked it. I don't know what it is, but I like it. I do. She Lily looks Collins like usually does pretty well. She looks like she's mourning. Because she's holding her rosary. Oh. And she's crying. Amina Seyfried looks like a freaking cherub. I think it's cute because of her hair. And she has a color complement her hair. Like, I know it looks boring. She has like a, a really pretty crown on. You just can't tell. Okay, her you know one. what? I do like it. I don't know who you are, Jasmine Sanders, but you. We looked this up. We looked. No, we, I did. I did not. I was a fan. I'm obsessed with her hair. And it went to her. You could have done better. You could have done more. But you're in charge of it, so you don't have to. Blake Lively always brings it. One of the best dressed by far. It doesn't screen the theme like totally. Like it's very Renaissance Catholic. Yeah. Like it, it's no Rihanna dressing that. as the Pope. Oh, Rihanna. But this, I I would think this to me personally, this is the most beautiful dress of the entire night. It took yeah over six hundred hours to make Blake's dress. Was it hand stitched? Save the worst for last. So Liza Koshy was the correspondent for Vogue at these events. So she literally got to talk to everyone. And they dressed her in this okay. Top Shop H and M Forever Twenty One jumpsuit with lace covering it. So meets going to a coffee shop. Well, I hope you enjoyed our commentary. Hopefully, this video doesn't end up too long. This is gonna be our last video for I don't know, maybe years. I hope not. I mean, you never know how to end these things. But it's over. Subscribe. <laughs> should be the end. Happy exploring. Stop, that was so much fun. And then have credits roll while we're doing funny talking. And like cut it out and so it's just the, with music. <laughs> yeah. We need like some papers to shuffle. Okay, bye. We're still on screen. We're still on screen. We're on your screen.